My impression about Yip Man is he is uh, he don't look like a kung fu man. He look like a scholar with uh, his look very refined, graceful, and erudite. And in 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 the film, I tried because the director asked me to combine Bruce Lee character into Yip Man, mm -hmm. so I tried to uh, portray my ideal Yip Man myself. So I tried to blend in Bruce Lee character into the Yip Man character. I think I learned a lot from Bruce Lee because Kawai asked me to uh, merge Bruce Lee character into Yip Man. So I study a lot, uh, not just his movie, but his books about his thinking of Kung Fu and his philosophy. So I still, it impressed me a lot and I'm still trying to uh, figure it out through training. That's why I'm still very interested in learning, in, in practicing Kung Fu. Not just for the, uh, for the technique, but try to, f try to, and try to uh, work out the spiritual side of Kung Fu. And that is very interesting to me. This is not just an action movie. I, th I think this is a movie about the culture of, uh, Chinese Kung Fu, as well as the as well as the Chinese culture, and also some uh, and also a lost uh, uh, lost martial arts world, the beauty of the martial arts world. Shen Xi is, I think, she is a very talented and hardworking actress. It's really tough for guys like me. After a few years training, I f still feel very difficult to master all the action scenes. But, but she can handle that. I think she is great. And, and after I watched the movie, I think he, she did a really brilliant job. She, I can see a lot of layers in her character, the evolve of a character from a, from a young uh, girl to a mature woman. I think she's great.